Hello friends, uh, welcome again and uh, this is my new project COVID detection using uh, X-ray and CT scan and this is a machine learning project and which I have developed in Python, Django and MySQL, the database I'm using the MySQL and the Python version I'm using is the Python version 3.7 and Django version is 2 and MySQL version is 5.6 for connecting MySQL with uh, Python and Django and using the MySQL connector. You can also use PyMySQL for running this project, right? Also, this is a machine learning project and I, uh, I have used four types of models. We have already uh, trained models and we are using the, those models for checking the X-ray uploaded by the uh, patients or the, I'm sorry, the admin and the CT scan uploaded by the admin, right? So this is the very latest topic in current scenario and the title as you are seeing that this is a COVID detection using X-ray and CT scan. So there are various type of uh, testing available in the market from which from which you can test that you are positive with COVID or not, but uh, like RT-PCR or antigen, but there is also a mechanism to test uh, COVID patient, means check that patient is infected with COVID or not, and that is uh, using the X-ray and CT scan, right? So if you have infected with COVID, then there will be some certain uh, scenario in your X-ray as well as in your CT scan, and after seeing those x-ray films the doctor will decide that you are infected with covid or not right so using those image data sets we have uh, more than thousand images for covid patient as well as non-covid patients we have thousand ct scans images for covid patient as well as non-covid patient and we have trained our models on those images and we have created the model files and if you upload your chest x-ray or ct scan uh, in this project then it will detect that you are infected with covid or not right so this is purely machine learning project for front-end development you can see uh, this is the web ui so for front-end development i have used the html css and javascript some of the jquery library also i have used like for form validations and for many other things i have used the jquery plugins right so let's start with the project functionalities that we have implemented inside this project or the functional functionalities is available in this project so let's start so this is the home page of the project and this is totally static page you can see this is a simple home page and this is a bootstrap theme if you open this project in any of the browser then ui will not be distorted you can open it in mobile browser you can open it in mobile tab right so this is the home page of the project and this is totally static information this is the about project and it's about the project this is about the covid virus only and this is also a static page if you want to change the content then you can change directly from the about.html which is available in the templates folder this is a login page and without login you will not be able to check your x-ray or uh, ct scan so there is only single user login available here that is the admin right admin can log in and admin can check uh the x-ray and report this is a contact us page this is a static contact us page i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page this is a real type google map and you can see this is the for development purpose only and it's working fine but it will work only if you have proper internet connection else it will not work right so now i am now i am going to log in as an admin so the user id is admin and the password is test -E -E once you sign inside the system you will get a dashboard right you can perform these operations inside the system you can upload the x-ray and check that you are infected with covid or not you can upload your ct scan as well and the system will predict or check that you are infected with covid or not using your ct scan right the system will analyze your ct scan report and ct scan uh, image and it will decide that you are infected with covid or not right this is all x-ray reports so it, it will show you all of the past x-ray histories it will show you all of the now past ct scan is histories this is all of the image data sets which we are using 
for which we have used for trained our models for training our models this is a my account change password and logout so let me go through one by one so these all options are available here in the header bar also right so let me go through one by one by one again home i already explained you about us this is a dashboard this is now the <coughs> upload x-ray right it's saying that enter the patient name right so the title is covid detection using x-ray upload your x-ray report you need to upload your x-ray report here and after that once you upload uh, the report the x-ray film then the system will predict that you are infected with covid or not right so here you need to enter the patient name so suppose i am entering the patient name that is a jack Omar. and the x-ray date i think it's a uh, yesterday and x-ray of jackma right once you enter all of the details just choose x-ray report and i am choosing uh x-ray report the clear something clear x-ray report this one yep yeah this one i have this is the file name and once you click on the check for covid then system will upload your x-ray file and it will check behind the process a machine learning model will run and we have trained four models right those four model will check your x-ray and it will show you that you are infected with covid or not so there are four models available inside the system right so this it's a little bit it will take so after and so this is the result phase, right so after analyzing the things you can check okay so this there are four uh, so i already told you we have used four models the first one is the resnet prediction the second one is a vzz the third one is the inceptions and fourth one is the exceptions so these four uh, models we have trained right and this is the excel report uploaded by you and all of our models is saying that you are infected with the covid it means this is the four models and it's all are saying that you are infected with covid it means this x-ray patient is 100 percent covid infected right so it has been predicted by the models which we have trained on a lot of images right okay now so this is the x-ray now this uh, again i am checking for a non-covid patient suppose it's a Rajit Kumar and the date suppose this one Ajit Kumar x-ray right I'm using a non-covid patient right open so I have used a non-covid patient x-ray let's see what's it saying so the model is running behind the process and it will detect that it will check the x-ray it will analyze it means the machine learning using the machine learning models the x-ray will be analyzed and it will show you the result so it will take a little bit time to process the things because there are a lot of data set images available i will show you right okay so now the report is ready okay so there is one model is saying that there is some chances right 77 percent chances that you are covid but the other three models is saying that you are not covid infected means you are not covid infected right so you can see out of four three saying you are not covid infected the last one is saying that there is a chances of 77 percent that you are infected with the covid means coronavirus right so you can see there are four models here three saying that you are covid infected the one is saying that uh, not one is saying that you are covid infected and the accuracy is 77 percent means and this is the four which is saying that you are not covid infected <coughs> right so so this is for the x-ray right now i am going to all x-ray report you can see all of your x-ray reports here right so this is the result you can see all of the x-ray which you have scanned is available here 
right you can see view results and it will show you the results the previous all of the previous results right and if you check that i have performed some other analysis also you can see this is 100 percent covid so in case of this one is saying that 99 percent covid but all of other models is saying that 100 percent that x-ray the yeah, patient has 100 percent covid symptoms right now this is for the ct scan so there are two options one is for the x-ray right you can see this is for the x-ray and this is for the ct scan so now i'm going to upload ct scan right so there are two types of testing we have done here one is for with the x-ray and second is with ct scan now i am going to enter here the patient name suppose amit kumar right and the ct scan date is second amit kumar x-ray uh, ct scan ct scan right and now i am going to choose the ct scan report let me check this one yep yeah this one no not this one yes this one yes okay okay now i have to use this one image and check for the covid let's check that how the system is behaving for that i don't know that uh, the ct scan which i have uploaded uh, patient is infected with uh, covid or not let's see that what the system is giving the result right so there is also four model here for checking the ct scan report so the system is running and uh, the model which you have trained is checking that ct scan report right so let's see okay it's, it is taking time because ct scan image is uh, uh, yeah now the report is ready uh, you can check yep 100 percent covid means this patient is uh, has also COVID symptoms after analyzing the CT scan the system is predicting that you are infected with COVID 100% right so all of the four algorithms is saying that you are 100% COVID infected only the ResNet predictions is saying that you have 89.80% COVID right this is the accuracy right so all three uh, models are saying that you are 100% COVID infected right so now you can see all of the CT scan report here, right? You can see the results, right? So this is for the hundred percent. Now I'm going to check for some other because this is okay. Oh, so all of the CT scan report. The third one I'm checking. Let's see what's yeah. It's saying so this CT scan belongs to a healthy patient means non-covid patient right it's saying that you are not covid patient means after analyzing the ct scan it's saying that you don't have covid symptoms right so this is the uh, all of the ct scan reports right now i am going to show you the image data set so we have used a four image data set first image for the x-ray without covid the second is with covid the third one is without covid ct scan and with covid ct scan if you want to see all of the images just click on the view data set image you will get all of the image which we are using for training our models machine learning models you can see these all are the x-rays so there are uh, 3 3 6 24 into 25 right it will be near about more than 800 images currently available here for the non-covid patient without covid right this is the non-covid x-rays <coughs> right okay so you can see this is the non-covid x-rays now if you want to see the covid patient x-ray so just click on that data set and this the second data is set uh, x-ray is for the covid x-ray <coughs> right so these x-ray are the are for the covid patients right okay so you can see this x-rays are for the covid patient now uh, if you want to see the ct scan of the covid patient just click on the without covid you can 
click on the without covid and you will get all of the images this ct scan is for the without covid patient there are also more than 600 images here right 600 images right you can check this these uh, image uh, ct scan uh, reports as for the non covid patient if you want to check the ct scan for the covid patients this is the last one data sets okay so these are uh, ct scan for the x-ray patients uh, sorry the covid patients right this is the my account section from where you will be able to update your account details right and then after that this is a change password from where you can update your account password right the email and, and the logout so this is the session driven menu if you click on the logout then all of the admin option will not be displayed because it's a rendering according to the session but if you log inside the system then you will get all of the administrative options right so you can see it's coming here right so these all functionalities i have developed inside this project the covid detection using x-ray and ct scan and this is a major project uh, developed in python machine learning django and mysql right and uh, i have used the four machine learning models for checking the x-ray for analyzing the x-ray and the ct scan and it's predicting i'm not saying that this is a hundred these um, uh, models are giving hundred percent accurate result but it's a prediction that after analyzing the x-ray and ct scan you have the covid symptoms or not the system is predicting that right so if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much